always had an interest in flying. When I was your age, my cousin flew a small airplane and he would take me with him sometimes. I thought it was so cool. I even thought about becoming a pilot at one time, but never fully pursued it. I really enjoyed photography. Since I got this job in phot photogrammetry, my interest in photography really took off. I even ended up buying several cameras for myself and have asked to take photos for it people's weddings and at church. With the combination of my previous experience as a land surveyor and my interest in aviation, photogrammetry, this job was a natural fit for me. I work in a photogrammetry department at the North Dakota Department of Transportation. We capture aerial photos of highways, cities, airports, rivers, and other areas as needed. Our road designers use the photos to design roads and bridges to find historic artifacts and villages for viewing river flooding and land erosion. The photos are also used to create exhibits for public hearings and airport directories. There are several reasons why I chose my career. So this is the equipment we use. Uh, it's a 100 megapixel um, digital mapping camera. It's got eight lenses underneath and the eight lenses are used, we could take all at the same time black and white photos, color photos, or near infrared photos. It all depends what the customer requests. Um, it sits on a stabilizer plate so it stays level with the ground as we're flying if we're hitting turbulence, and I'll demonstrate that. So as we're flying along and it, if there's any turbulence going on, the camera will st stay level with the ground so we don't get any, any blurring. When we're done capturing photos, they're all stored on the solid state uh, drive. Uh, it's a three quarters of a terabyte. Um, drive I bring back to the office and I download it can store up to um, 2500 um, 300 megabyte images this whole system is um, 350 pounds um, 270 pounds sit right over the hole it comes apart in pieces in case we have maintenance um, to do on the camera or in case we got to take it out for passenger flights. So we have a door to protect the camera lens on uh, landings and also for going through uh, rain and stuff, it keeps the rain off the lens. And this is a, how it looks when we're in turbulence and the camera's um, moving around underneath. And then when we're done with our phone emission, then we close the door to protect the lens. We close, close the door, Mike. What to expect in my career? Working with the pilots, our pilots are very skilled at what they do. We work together to get the shots right. Working as a team with other others in my department as well other departments such as field surveyors and designers. You must be flexible with your schedule because we have to fly when the weather conditions allow it and that may even mean quickly getting ready at their last minute, making phone calls and scheduling things. You have to be open to learning new things because technology is always changing. You need to be able to withstand airplane turbulence sometimes Airplane cabins are pressurized, so you need to be able to withstand higher altitudes.